Hello and welcome back to the second episode of this let's play for the Great American Farms map. Actually I think it's I think I accidentally said the wrong thing. I think it's called Great American Farming Map. Uh, but it said Great American Farms when you look at the briefing page, so that's probably why I said it wrongly. But anyway, Great American Farming Map. Um, if you remember from last time I said I was going to sell off all the equipment and buy some new equipment, so I've done that. First thing, first thing I bought was the cashier. This is a mod and cheaper than the one in game. Then I bought this New Holland TF78. Uh, Very nice. Also quite cheap. I bought a corn header. This wasn't as cheap. Uh, but we needed one because we're in America and they grow a lot of corn there. So we bought that. Um, then we bought this Flegel trailer to bring home some bales. And if you looked at my last series, you knew I used a buy bale mod, which is quite new. Uh, you can find it in the description, the link for it. And so I bought some grass bale, uh, hay bales and some straw bales just to get us going on the farming on the farm then I bought this humongous cedar it's a John Deere uh, 9218 I talked about it it's really nice works great skid steer with a shovel and a bale fork over there we go into the barn and got this disc I talked about uh, moco mower, got the 7530 tractor, um, I didn't talk about this legal trailer, this is the default one, um, but I needed something bigger than the brand, trailer, so I bought this one, uh, here we have the Amazon sprayer, which I talked about, we also have the um, in-game fertilizer spreader uh, the default which was on the map I just didn't sell that it's over there somewhere next to that barn and then I bought this New Holland F FX48 um, there's two versions of it it's the dirty one and the, the clean one uh, for some reason I took the dirty one and uh, I'm not liking it it's too dirty uh, but I guess for the price I paid for it uh, you probably can't expect too much. I can just pretend it's rust. So, uh, this is a self propelled forage harvester with a corn um, header. So, it's for cutting corn into chaff, which can go into this trailer. And then we'll put the chaff into the silo, which is uh, behind the um, barn where you keep the straw and hay and then we'll make some silage and then we can put uh, I'm not sure if it he works in this one this is one of the things we're gonna try today to put stuff in here so and then anyway we have 26,000 left after buying all this equipment so we're gonna buy some cows and uh, because it, uh, it's a dairy farm I wanna have cows so we'll buy as many as we can get um now you might wonder why okay so 10 so we got 10 cows um that's good let's just start let's see if we can see them anywhere where are the cows oh here they are oh mm, the pen you could probably put some feed there or if it's water it might be water uh, see if it's if if this map is water enabled, you will see it in the animals part. Let's see uh, production liquid manure manure feeding mixed rations silage grass straw and milk tank. So no no water, which is good. Don't have to think about that. Uh, so we'll have to add some straw straw bedding, then giving us something to eat. So we'll start with that. So we'll go to our small little skid steer which is perfect for these kinds of jobs oh just get rid of the shovel and we'll get our bale of 
fork. So straw bedding first and ten cows, not sure exactly how much straw bedding you need or how many bales it will take, so we'll just start with a few and see go from there. been trying to get I would like to get the steering wheel I have a steering wheel for my computer but I can't use it I tried to get it to work with farming simulator but it just doesn't work I, it's probably some setting somewhere it's, log it's really old, old one logitech well let's get through this oh crap maybe not and I was stuck. We drive backward. Uh, these we can get out of here, maybe. No. Okay, so that's probably not a good idea to go in. Oh crap! Oh, this is not going well at all. <laughs> okay, so I think last map I talked about the problem with the. That mod and the skid steer. I, I think it was when I was talking about um, har uh, cutting down lumber and trees and stuff. Uh, and here you can see it in action. It's really hard to get it to work. Is there any? Oh no, no there's no. That's good. So here, over here, just does, doesn't seem to be any. Okay, I have enough. Can't get out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, this is interesting. So, if you have it just the right height, you won't be able to get uh, get it done. So, so here we have we are in the barn. Let's see if we spread bait. So it's on top. Again, let's spread that one. We'll start with this one. So, okay. Um, anyway, when I was uh, doing forestry on the last map, uh, we had a problem where there was some uh, mud in the forest and skid steer got stuck there. Which it does quite easily, as I just demonstrated. It's another thing, this gives you just for some reason it it when the mod dirt mod doesn't really work together. Maybe it has too little mass or just or too little mass or it's not strong enough or something, but it doesn't work very well with the there. So, okay, so we'll do this bedding. You can think this gate opens so it closes. Well, well, I guess a cow could get by there if we wanted to. Let's get out. Spread rain. So this is quite a lot. Yeah. So, let's fall. Um, you can actually do this. You just leave the bait. So the next time when you need to re refill baits in the, in the cow pen, you just get in there, walk in there and spread it. You're using the spread mod. You don't have to. Of course, in reality, I'm guessing you wouldn't do that because then the cows would start eating it. Anyway, let's see. Uh, I'm gonna try to see if I could get this to work. So. Let's see here, silage, straw, and hay, the grass maybe? Not sure, we will take a piece of gra hay, probably, probably doesn't like it because it's hay. Okay. 
So we'll go over here, not sure if it... I never used this mod, I haven't played on the map where they had this mod, so I have no idea if it just accepted it. you pass it over. We'll drop it into it. Oh, okay. That worked. That looks weird. It looks really weird, but it worked. It accepted it. So, okay. So we'll see straw. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have any. Um, any silage. So I'm not sure if it will work and actually feed the cows. Uh, we could just set it to feed them straw, I guess. In the little pad, pad thingy. Here. See if this is the, if it's the middle one. Oh. Oh. oh yeah, that work. Straw in the middle one, grass and hay on the right side. And then I guess we'll have to harvest a bit of make some um, silage and then we can put silage in too and then we'll get a good total mixed rations. try and see if we can make it give the cows food. Okay, so we have um, let's see, ten, 10 cows. Feeder, let's see, more requirement per feeding. I'm not sure what that is. Go to feeding times, that sounds good. Um, mixing. So now we have. I wonder if there's a way to see how much. Oh, here it is. The distribution feeding. And not sure. Oh, there's different times. 7.30, 12.30, 18. Okay, so they say, so you feed them at 1800, they get that mix. No. Hmm. Number. Okay, doesn't make any sense. I really should watch a tutorial on how to use this. Um, but anyway, we'll we will start it. Okay, mix feed to start. Feed level silage is to oh, continue feeding. Silage amount. Okay. Okay. You're about to order. Uh, let's see. I don't have as much money, do I? It's free. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is cool. So I can buy silage. Oh, this is brilliant. Yes. Buy. Left bunker. The silage field contractors will build. Okay. So. Uh, so grass, I eat that straw, 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 silage. Uh, so I could actually buy the 8000 minus 1500 is six, so like that. Yes, buy that. So the problem is failed. Okay. okay, so now we have eight. Grass, straw, everything is 8,000. Back home. Back home. Ah, okay, so I see. So here we have that. Okay, so that's a good thingy. The bunker thingy, here's the feeder thingy. So 10 cows, um, we have the settings. So uh, I don't want that, I want 
40. Didn't I save it? Mm, oh, okay, I'm sorry. I guess I didn't save it. Um, okay, it's 40, 40, 20. That. Uh, oh, 40, sorry. 40. Forty, forty, twenty. That's that's a hundred. Okay, so I'll go back and try start mix film and start now. Okay, restart it. Or we can. I don't know what this. Hmm. Seven thirty-eight nine. Twelve thirty. Turn roll while loading. Turn roll while driving. Turn roll mixing. I have no idea. Uh, feeding, feeding. Light at feeders. I can play with capital. So how do you get? So we can't start it manually. Think I was even just. I have to wait. Oh no, okay, so, okay. Okay, yeah, this is, okay. So it goes, we fill there. Oh, uh, sorry. Oh, probably some sort of bug. And then it goes where? Where does it go? It goes over here. That's a mixer. Mixing station, okay, cool. So it mixes. And then what happens to that? Where does it go? Oh, okay, so it goes on a thingy on the roof. Exit. Now it just goes. Um, this could be very interesting. Where are the cows? Over there. So then it feeds them automatically um three times a day and since we set amount of cows we have we also give them the right amount of food so we don't so feed them more food than we need so we just keep that topped up now it's getting okay now it's reaching so now it's it's unloading Loading, loading, loading. So I guess that should be 600 something liters would be the correct feeding for that time of day. But mostly the coolest part was you could actually buy silage. Uh, I'm not sure if it was expensive, I guess probably expensive compared to making it your own by yourself. Which we'll, we'll we'll do that. We'll just uh, soon as the entrance. Oh, so now it goes back. Oh, this is so amazing. And so if we look at our cows, we should they should have um, feeding trough mixed ration six hundred and forty eight liters. Okay. So this is interesting. Um, well, we could rather fill up the, the stations for the hay and hay and straw. But we don't need as much straw because um, doesn't use as much straw for every feeding. Only 20% compared to 40% of the uh, hay and of the silage. I'm still, I'm still really amazed that you could actually buy silage. Uh, um, I wouldn't. Uh, this transporting this thing, there was a complete waste of time and buying the. Oh, why is this working? Okay, that's good. That's one way you're doing it. So, uh, let's see, two more for this. Put 
this one over here. And then we grab one more. This would be down here. this one wonder what it would be if you had two joysticks and could drive this the way the real skid steer would drive could probably I could work pretty cool let's see oh wrong way so we will get this these two bales of straw which we bought at the store with the buy bale mod buy yeah, bale, bale mod oh. and we will sell them oh sorry we will sell them here oh. hmm did that go into okay so that was weird so if I accident think I accidentally put straw into the silage part and it actually filled up. It must be a bug. I have to try that again. Do it with one straw bale. And put it in here. I'm guessing it's not the way it's supposed to be uh, but that's good for me I got some more silage uh, <laughs> I'm paid for straw but I'm gonna try to keep it pretty real because I did actually buy a self-propelled harvester just to get cut down the corn with corn stalks so I could could make some signage. That uh, would be pretty useless not to use it. Okay, what's the film? It's good, we don't have to use do anything about those in quite some time because there isn't that much silage per day. Yes, okay. Turn it off. And now we are let's see, we have to twenty three minutes. We're gonna start this um, uh, combine up. Uh, I'm going to get our header. And then I'm going to go to field number three to start our harvest. And then I'm gonna bring out the tractor and the trailer to get this when it's needed. This is a small field. I, I won't do this entire field um, when recording because it's just a f combined going up and down a bit. And uh, you can probably do some more fun things to watch than that. Yeah, start now, unfold. This is cool, this is really cool. I wonder what it looks like when you harvest. to turn off the disable straw so I think okay. it's nothing wrong with it I just I bought a bunch of bales I think I need uh, to get the straw swath so. and um, probably I have nothing to collect it with I have no money I'm minus eight nine seven seven pounds I have no money uh, I don't have, I can't buy anything to collect this store as well but so I just anyway I'll just leave it and spread it out and then I will uh, cultivate it into the ground with a cultivator we need a trailer here 
MP to Oh, that's tight. No, that's not gonna work. That's probably not the way you do it in real life. So let's see. I hope this takes. Uh, I hope this takes uh, grain, because otherwise I don't know. <laughs> I have to buy another one, and another trailer which I don't have, and I have to make money because it's just taking away that's th th why it's taking away so fast is because I have hired a worker so if I I could oh it's full really that's oh, that's fast uh, so I guess it's a small really small combine actually I think it's about 4000 uh, compared to the class dominator 88 which I used on um, old streams map uh, where it used it got, I think 4,500 4, this is I think 4,000 so let's hope it empties into the tra legal tra trailer and then I should probably go do a headland yes it did We're good probably do a headland and save money by not using higher worker higher worker uh, mod but that's for next time so anyway thank you for watching this second episode the first real work I've done on this farm uh, so thank you for watching the great American farming map and uh, thanks for listening and if you like this please press like and uh, if you want to sub subscribe please do that and have a nice day or evening or whatever the time is at your place. Okay. Take care. Bye bye.